Alex, you want to check out the caves, or...? Yeah, let's do it. Boost me up? Yeah, come on. You're gonna mess with wire shark. Oh, nice. Come on, I'll push you <laughs> over. So today's oh, when you're doing oh, that. Oh, I forgot. Whenever you're ready. Oh, what, so, your the cave. What's your bets? On a scale of 1 to 10, how weird's it gonna be? Um... Hmm, probably a 5. Weird enough to remember, but not weird enough to tell anybody about it after. <laughs> All right. Hey, Chris seems to be her normal annoying self. Sorry about that. Yeah, what's her deal anyway? I don't know. That woman's perpetually on her period. Uh, Yikes. Ren, I'm standing right here. Oh, you know, I keep forgetting you're a girl. Thanks for, uh, <laughs> that sounds like hidden the spike trap. In the, uh, the game. I didn't think you would, but you know, you could have and you didn't, so thanks. Well, yeah, I mean, I wouldn't throw you in the deep end or anything. Not like a certain person who yelled at Andrew Finnegan about a certain junior high dance right in the middle of gym class. That was a joke, and he agreed, so no regrets. Now, who's ready to have their minds blown? If you don't mean that literally, I am... Me, me, me. Oh, wait, actually, I almost forgot. Gonna take a little magic trip to Cupcake Town. Those look like brownies. Brownie town. Come on, Ren. The last thing I want is to have to chase your frail, screaming body. So I turn down ocean. smoking. I'm turning down the happy brownies. What? Jonas is gonna do it too. Cupcake Town, uh, really? That's your takeaway. Mikomita, Sukomita? Uh, no thanks. I'm with her on the whole not flipping out and drowning myself thing. Okay. Hmm. Delicious. Okay, so see these little piles of rocks? The kids before I turned down weed brownies, so you yeah. Know where to try and tune in the signal. So you're gonna want to stand basically right around here, and just tune the dial left or right until you start hearing some weirdness. Yeah, this is where it starts picking up. How will we know when it's? You'll know. Trust me. So just pull out your radio. Yeah, you see that? Any day. Holy crap! Wow, it's even cooler than I thought it would be. How, how is this, how can this be possible? Starting to get Maybe interesting. Like unblocking a weather balloon or something? <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Well, it's just crazy then, cause I don't know. If you move around, it kind of changes too, I think. Like, over at this pile. Here, come over here and try it. This is so cool. I know. Clarissa and Nona should see this, right? I mean, I know it's like weird with you guys or whatever for some reason, but they, they're fine where they are. Okay, just what is Clarissa's issue with you two? She dated Michael for five seconds like three years ago. It was for a couple of months a year and a half ago. Whatever, she never liked me, not even then. I was always the little sister who got in the way, who she had to climb in through windows to sneak around. Clarissa's the kind of person who doesn't feel full unless she's pissed at somebody, so... <clears throat> Brownies are kicking in. That makes sense? Kind of? I got it. Okay, good. Now, there's another cool spot, I think, over here. Okay, another cool spot, huh? If you want to bring it on over... Sounds so. Yeah, it sounds. Uh. It sounds. like painful. Yeah. Wait, what was that? <coughs> yeah, let's just go straight there's towards like, the glowing green this thing. It's gonna sound stupid, but there's like something in here. Famous last words. Famous last words. Uh, yeah, what is that? I'm sure there is something in there, like a giant rabies-filled bat, or a maniac who wears mannequin wigs. Or it kind of looks like a pool or something, like a freshwater one, maybe. Let's check it out. It's not that far in. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have this thing about crawling into strange, dark, wet places that might cave in at any moment. It's not gonna... Come on, I can see it from here. It's not that far. We'll be in and out. <laughs> in and out. <laughs> Damn it, Rin! <laughs> Fortune favors the bold. 
<laughs> Wait a minute, Jonas. Well, I am going to just rest against here because I think, shh, I think I mismeasured the map. What the hell, Ren? You and your cupcakes. Yeah, look, there's Clarissa, Clarissa, Calorilla, Calorilla, right there. The jerk girl. We call her Jural. I'm gonna start using that too, Hidden Spike Chat. Mismeasured the magic. Every time a joke doesn't land, I'm just gonna be like, I must have mismeasured the magic. Interesting, weird kind of sound if you guys hear that, like, uh, ambient background music. It's almost like a music box that's slightly out of tune. Like those little wind-up music boxes. Jonas is missing. <laughs> you like things out of tune, hidden spike trap. But no, there is something about that, right? Like the wind up, the wind up music boxes that are slightly out of tune are inherently creepy. Like they're just so far out of, like barely out of the realm of normal that it's, it's unsettling. Why would a guy bring an ashtray down here, or a pen? That's a good question, um, Evil Mumu Chan. I don't know. I know I picked something slightly different this time, but nothing big. See a man about a dog. Sure, will do. Are you okay? Ah, Jesus, you scared me. Oh, I scared you? You scared me. I had no idea where you were. I'm sorry for going ahead. I thought, I thought I heard somebody down here, but you know. Obviously, there isn't. Isn't this place incredible? I mean, I don't even know how this... how this happens. No, it's... Uh, it's beautiful. See? That's what I heard. It sounds like a person almost, right? Kinda? I don't know where it's coming from. What could that be? Echoes? Sounds of the ocean bouncing off the walls? It's me. I failed geology. There was a light in here somewhere. I still want to see what made it. It must just be further in. Let's try and find it before we go back. Well, seeing as how I crawled in here to get you. Is Utility Man hitting on Jonas? Yeah, and I mean... Again? If it's cool, we can get the others. And if it's not, we'll just leave. Like, what is this made out of? Is it ice? What? Wow, how is that... Did did you see the floating, um, triangle light thing? Yeah, I see it. Um, yes. It, it must be like a, like a rainbow or like a reflection of light. Those, um, exist, right? Sure, why not? Let's go with that for the time being. I think this is all tied to when you tuned in those weird signals out there and the, um, what am I trying to say? I, I think that you tuned in this little guy somehow. I think it's all the same thing. Really? You think? Definitely. Try your radio. Maybe that's like a frequency or something. Like- Apart from the, um, the triangle, this is honestly the craziest thing in here. Like, how did it even get in? And I mean, aside from some, like, water damage, it's not really even that junky. I know. Alex, just- Look, I think you tuned in the triangle when we were outside. So let's see what else happens if you tweak the dial some more. I guess it's locked. Yeah, I already tried. Come on, bring out the radio. Let's see if the triangle thing will react at all. Saw the man, not the dog. What the crap does that mean? A guy who can't see dogs? 
Did you see the first half? <laughs> Man, dog? Yeah, I don't get it either. It's radio time. Let's do it. Come on. Radio time. Oh my god. Is this... Are you... Is this... You? Are you doing this? Should... Should I stop? No! This is awesome! See his drawing when I tune. What is what? Is it, it what? Sleepy time gal. Throw rocks at it. Um, uh, maybe, but I, I don't really. Bob two. Please, children. Bye. Alex. <laughs> Th this is safe. This is safe. And that's as far as I got before hitting stream, so I figured, okay. That's the point where I said, okay, maybe maybe you guys would want to see this game. Alex! Alex! What's he doing to her? Alex. Oh, helping. Are you okay? You all right? What happened? That is a very good question. Look, I'm just gonna cut to the whatever. Like, I don't know exactly what happened back there, but the sign says that's an old communications tower, and I don't know about you, but I want to climb that ladder, call somebody, and get the hell back home as fast as possible. I don't want to be the party pooper here, but the party just... I don't know. This is kind of exciting, right? Exciting? Alex, we don't... To think something's exciting, you kind of have to know what that something is first. And we just got crapped out of the laser light show from hell, so... Yeah, we don't know what's going on, but it's like weird and crazy and magic, so... I mean, don't you want to... No, I don't. Whatever you're going to say, unless it's leave, I don't want to at all. Oh, and not for nothing. I'm fine with a little deep pantsing or whatever if the weather's right for it. But if this is some sort of prank or trick, I'm really... Really not in the mood. Jonas, believe me, I wouldn't do that to you. I'm not that cruel. <sighs> okay, well, I hope so. Just cross your fingers the comm tower has a working walkie-talkie or something. Where's everyone else? Ren and Clarissa. <sighs> I have no idea. I don't know if they even know that anything happened. Pardon Tower. Oh, it's called that, I think because the radio man who watched it, he was Major Richard Harden. I don't know why I remember that. <laughs> Wait, the guy's name was Major Dick Harden? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that would explain why I remember it. Who builds towers like this? I guess people do. They're, they're everywhere. We see towers like this all the time, but still. That's a lot of steps. <laughs> yeah.
Oh, I want to see this view. You can see the cave, but not Ren or anybody. What do you think happened to them? Probably heard all the noise and hmm. ran off instead of trying to come help us. Great. <sighs> it's locked. Let me try. Oh, after you. Oh, why, thank you. What, is he a lockpick now? What are you even doing? Just have a little faith. See? That'll do, pig. That'll do. Really? That'll do, pig? You're welcome. Okay. But there is a window right here I could have climbed in. Oh, that's kind of cool lighting. How does this thing... It does! Ah! Jesus! Hello? Alex? Alex? What? Oh, Jesus, Hoppin' Christ! Thank Vishnu! I... You guys went into that hole and a bunch of stuff. I have no idea what happened. I just woke up like 15 minutes ago. I, I saw the light on in the, uh, the tower thing. <laughs> hey, did you know that it's named after some guy named Dick? Oh my god, Ren. <laughs> Ren, how are you calling us? Phones don't work here. It's, it's a code written on this list here. But it's not a normal phone. I can't call out. I'm at, uh, the way station or whatever in the woods. It's been like, like, just the worst thing ever. Just DEFCON Fuchsia level terrible ever since you went into the Ren, cave. are you alright? Like, physically alright? Because I know mentally you're no, probably... No, I'm not alright! I mean, do I sound <coughs> alright or do I sound not alright? I probably sound not alright, Damn right? it, Ren. Wait, I, I, I think that's the other line. Maybe it's like a night watchman or something? Or they Wait, do... Ren, someone's calling on the other line. Just hold on a minute. I'm gonna see who it is. Okay, but make it quick. Seriously. Hello? Oh, Jesus Christ, Alex? Why are you answering it? This, it says it's an emergency line. Where are you right now? Clarissa. And Jonas is with you. Of course he is. Okay, look, Clarissa. Ren's on the other line and sounding like he's about a stub toe away from a total collapse, so if you're at least holding it together, Wait, wait, wait. Then... I, I'm at Fort Milner, and I can't... I don't remember, like, the last hour, and it's, like, really scaring the crap out of me. I'm trying to call somebody, but I'm in a room with radio stuff that can... It says it can contact Kamina, but I don't... I have no idea how to make it work. Can you just come over here and figure this out with me? I don't No, just come here instead. Fort Milner's all the way on the other side of the island. Yeah, I know it is, Alex, but why would I go to the comm tower when there's a working radio that we can use to get help here? Fort Milner looked huge on the map. Do you know where the... And it dies, ladies and... Ren, are you still there? All right, they're all dead. Jonas, you and me, we're leaving so without him. Want to truck over to Milner first? See about that radio. I mean, Clarissa can be a handful, but gotta take the bitter with the sweet. Ren sounded kind of more out of sorts than usual. I don't know. Look, I'm gonna leave it up to you. We can swing through the forest and nab Ren, or we can go to the fort and see what Clarissa's up to. They're your people. You can decide. Ren needs us more, and he'd kill me if he knew we went to see Clarissa first. Sound logic. So, save Ren. He's there. So, is Clarissa just going to straight up die now? I hope so. Does it make me a bad person? Be off now. Great, but um, don't take offense if I want to throw a stick at it first. Well, I will, and have taken offense at your not believing in my ability at flipping switches. <laughs> SOS, Mayday, Mayday, um, CQD? CQD? Yeah, I was thinking that utility, man, like it was a trick question. That's some creepy murmurings. It's, um, dead. Did you get anyone? I think someone was there, but I don't know. Warning, do not use aboard ship. Unsafe... Radiation limits. You know, I'd normally find this stuff kind of interesting, really. You know, normally. 
Thanks, I guess. If Rin dies and Clarissa lives because of this choice, I'm uninstalling Oxenfree. I just want that out there. What if they both die? Then Ren is just collateral damage for removing the true evil from the world. And it sucks, but we must carry on. We have to be strong for them. Yeah, see, Utility Man gets it. He knows. Ren would want us to carry on. In a Clarissa-free world. Dang, Jonas, you're slow as hell. Come on. I'm not even, like, full sprinting. I don't even have a sprint on shift key. Like, that's not a thing in this game. How are you so slow? If I get out of his line of sight, he'll disappear. Is that how it works? So, just curious, but um, what's your running theory? Well, you played with the radio, a triangle came out, the triangle talked, hung out a little, then drowned us, but not, and now we're here. Yeah, okay, but what does it all mean? That's between you and your priest. All right, so if we hit tab to look at the map, which we don't get to, because tab isn't a thing. Okay, the woods, that's where we need to go, right? Through the woods to get to Ren? That's true, that is kind of like the status quo in horror movies. You have a point. I um didn't realize just how much woods there were. This is like a, like a genuine forest. What's the matter? Not the outdoorsy type? Well, if it's in a city with concrete and a little open all-night pancake place, then yeah, I'm outdoorsy and that I'm outdoors. All right, Jonas is automatically sure. terrible because no, he said pancakes the, instead of waffles. You know where we're going? We... Not, uh, not exactly, no. Not exactly? I got the map right here, it's fine. Worst character, you, you mean? Know, this whole place really creepily reminds me of a park or woods, I guess, near where I used to live. It's really kind of felt just like this. Oh, yeah? What was that one called? Oh, Jesus, what are you doing jumping across that? There's another, there's like another way down here. I can't believe you even made Relax. it. Relax, it's not as big a jump as it looks. You, uh, barely made it, but okay, I guess. Man. My dad was really happy to move here, you know. He said the schools were safer, less... Damn, I was kind of hoping the pancake heretic would fall. Guess considered the danger of whatever's happening right now. But, you know... Yep. Yeah, we once had a mall Santa who was kidnapping kids. I think that's been so far the scariest thing that's happened. Well, I mean, to be fair, that does sound pretty scary. Do I not get to, like, hit tab for map? Guess not. Not there, at least. Find out that Clarissa is a waffle fan. I'll have to change my views of Clarissa, Clarissa at that point. 